Hey, it's Rob again. And, uh, yeah, my next random. I'm going to open a box because uh, it's not very exciting. But it's a vacuum cleaner. Yeah. So, my original one here. The beater ended up giving up. Focus. There we go. Ish. Yep, there. See this? It's not supposed to be like that. So, this Bissell sucked. So, what we're going to do is I got this guy right there. And forgive this lovely carpet because uh, it's all going to get uh, torn out and the original oak's coming back along with uh, the repair of all the plaster and paint and all that kind of stuff. Because, you know, this is all about a, oh, I don't know, almost 100-year-old house. So, you know what, there's some cracks. But uh, we're going to fix it up and uh, you guys get to watch. So, anyways, back as I... Here is basically the cheapest vacuum you can get on Amazon. So let's open her up and see how she does. So we went with this great Eureka Power Speed. Yeah, I think it cost me 50 bucks on Amazon. And uh, yeah, the quality of the thing feels about like a kid's Nerf gun. No light, cause well, you know what? We don't need to see what we're sucking up. We just want it gone. Got some directions. Now, I'll get rid of these in a minute. I need those parts first. And then a miscellaneous assortment of other paraphernalia. So, let's lock and load. So the thing's relatively easy to put together. This snaps on, you put this on. Um, it's got some little attachment crap things, but uh, it's got one more attachment than uh, what it's got slots for, I guess, as part of the budget-friendly features. So uh, we don't need that. Um, i got to put on the little cord twirler upper thingy. And, uh, yeah, kind of checking this guy out. Uh, it doesn't have attachment tube to make it, like, longer. You just undo the hose and, like so. And you lock it into this guy with this super awesome little twist lock deal. And then you just take her out and you can run and gun. Kind of, I guess, is the plan. So, but, yeah, back to, back to reassembly crap. This guy rocks out. It's got the little flipper do on the bottom so she opens up. Then as for maintenance, this thing, oh, Forgive my couch. It's ugly. I don't really care. But uh, one of these days I'll get to getting something else. But it's got this crappy little filter thing in here that uh, allegedly, uh, in whatever language you choose to listen to it in, tells you what to do with it. Apparently, uh, yeah, you flip to do it and uh, you lift it up in the arrow orientation and then you spray it underneath the water and then you put it out by a big black dot of some sort. Looks like the coronavirus. Yeah. And then you reassemble. And then you can take out that little center thing and get any goodness that might get uh, caught up in there. So, yeah. Not quite sure uh, how well it's gonna hold up because uh, I don't really have good luck with vacuum cleaners because, well, it doesn't seem to matter how much I pay for them. They all seem to give me about a year, year and a half. I don't know, just the way it is. So we'll work it out. Now let's see how this thing runs. Remember how I threw out those directions? Well, wouldn't you know it, I opened it up to take out the little hooks that you put the cord on, and it has the attachment thing there. So it does have the trifecta of all the different attachments for uh, your fuzzy suckings and your crack suckings and your things that need little like velvet deal suckins, so. All right. Now back to seeing how it works. All right, here's the moment of truth. You got the little foot pedal here to kick her on. Then you got the foot pedal here to uh, let her go into recline. So, here we go. Well, oh yeah, relaxation. All right, here goes nothing. Wow, it's whisper quiet. I can't even tell it's running! So, here we go. Wow, look at them lines. 
This thing's getting after it. Look at it go. Look at it go. I don't even know what I was sucking up. All right. Let's see what we sucked up. All right, we got a we got a canister of stuff. Now, mind you, I had vacuumed this not too long ago with our old vacuum, and uh, yeah, I only did this small amount here, and I'm not worried because you know what? I have a vacuum cleaner that'll suck the mess back up. So this is everything that it just sucked up. Look at it! Look at it! Okay, I'm a big dude. I got big hands. This right here is like a toupee for some like poor person. I don't know about you, but uh, I'm fairly happy. So I look forward to the next two and a half years. Well, year and a half, I'm probably going to get out of this thing. So I don't even know. Oh, look at this. It's even got settings. What, what did I have this thing set on? All right, I wasn't at low carpet, but I was at... All right, so oh, look at that. The features. The features. I love it. So you want yourself a cheap vacuum, and you want something that sucks up junk. I think this is our boy. Yeah, look at that. So, I'm going to give that a thumbs up for the Eureka Power Speed. Sold on Amazon.